with those three that are your favorite, what makes them different from the popular 2018 female rappers like Nicki Minaj, Cardi B, and I don't know, another third one. Like uh, Rico Nasty? I don't even, nah, like super pop. Yeah, so what make them different between those two is Jean Grey, she give you bars. So I respect that Nicki Minaj write her own bars, but they're just not that good to me. Like Nicki Minaj has, <gasps> she writes her own bars, but like her metaphors, certain things she says, to me, I've always been really elementary. <gasps> I like her Sucker Free mixtape. I like her Being Me Up Scotty mixtape. I thought Pink Friday was serviceable for what it was. I wasn't bumping that. Like, I don't replay that. But <laughs> I did think Your Love was a dope, uh, was a dope single. Moment of Life featuring Drake was dope. Uh, so I respect what Nicki does, but she got four albums. It's like that one Jay-Z bar. Four albums in 10 years, nigga. I can divide. It's so one every, let's say, two. Two of them shits was due. Like, she got, it's been 10 years. She's dropped four albums. Out of those four albums, you say, okay, Queen was all right. Pink Friday was, was good. The rest was due. Like, what Nas said to Jay-Z. I feel like Jean Grey is really giving you bars. Like, when you listen to Everything's Fine, Jean Grey is really giving you metaphors. She's really giving you, like, bars where you sit back and then, like certain concepts and certain um, you know, literary terms that she's throwing at you, certain metaphors, they gonna hit you later. Um, and not only that, but just the content of what she's rapping about. Everything's Fine is really an album about depression, isolation, um, in this social media world, in this technology world that we live today. So she's really touching on relevant topics. When you listen to her music 15, 20 years down the line, a lot of things are still gonna be relevant. It's gonna feel like she wrote that album in that time. Um, so that's why I feel like Jean Grey is a, a step above the Cardi B's and the Nicki Minaj's and her whole discography is like that.